Welcome back once again, everybody. We just did a lot more searching and we are currently not in the safest of places. And this was not pro probably not the best part for me to start to record, but uh, we wanted to do a little searching first before we rescued this first guy here. As you can see, there are skulls here and he needs to be saved. Hopefully there's some energy drinks here because I do need to drink. But, oh shoot, this guy's a Yeah, watch out behind you. <clears throat> but yeah, we were searching and searching for this location, so I had to look up a map, and I found it. This is actually one of the first people you could, oh shoot, you could meet. Oh, nice. Yeah, I definitely need some duct tape. Thing is, I think there's a glitch with this guy that he takes all of the alcohol, and since I'm carrying pretty much all of the alcohol for Harlan, you may want I'm, you may want to talk to him. I don't know how much alcohol you're carrying. I feel like I got raisin legs in the head. Oh, you have 13? Stomach. Hmm. Well, let me do this. Let me just drop some of the alcohol that I have. And so that he doesn't take it all. Yeah, I have 17 alcohol. So I'm going to drop uh, 14. One, two, three. Are they disappearing? Just to make sure. Okay, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. All right. So I dropped fourteen, and I may just drop two more because I don't know if he'll take three and then count it as one. Um. Actually, actually, I'll just I'll keep the three. I'll keep the three. I mean, it's so bloody bright. Oh, five. Okay. Well, I'll talk to him right now. Where the hell am I? Oh yeah, it's coming back to me now. I was chased in here by a mob of bloody maniacs. I was able to lock them out, but I had to kill the bloody bartender. The crazy git was trying to bite me. Didn't have nothing to eat, but I had a hell of a lot to drink. But now I'm all out and hung over as hell and need a bit of the hair of the dog that bit me, huh? Think you can find me some more booze? I'll make it worth your while. I can't really turn you down now, Good. can I? I'll wait here, if you don't mind. I'm not really up to moving around. Alright, so this Stanley guy, yeah, we need five bottles of alcohol. I'll give him the three that I have. Two. Three. This is actually not a continuous event like the game tells you. Once you give him too many, it's just like Harlan. Once you give him too many, then he'll uh, finish the quest for you. So we'll give him five now. Good. And we'll do five more. And maybe we could use the alcohol that you've collected to give to Harlan, unless you've given him some. Stanley's some. Huh? Good. I'll wait here, if you don't mind. I'm not really up to moving around. Another five bottles. Four. Five. Two. Three. Four. Good. I'll wait here, if you don't mind. I'm not really up to moving around. Alright, so he still needs five more. I think I'm gonna throw... I Oh. oh, oh, never mind. The quest completed. Nice. There's, yeah, there's, and, um, actually, I'm going to drop these alcohols for you so that you can be in charge of giving them to Harlan. But he acts the same way once you give him, um, enough alcohol. He just closes the door on you and starts to puke. But 
as you can see, you get a lot of money out of giving it to them. So this is actually a pretty good quest if you're low on money. So now that that waypoint is gone, let me get rid of it. And yeah, one of, let's see, let's see where this goes. Yeah, let's go down this way. Okay, I made another waypoint. So, maybe we could run across someone else. <laughs> we really haven't visited the hotel bungalows very much. Oh, here's that bloody pool. I think this may be Ted B's pool, though. Actually. Even though he's not here anymore. Here comes another one. Or two more, in fact. Yeah, this is definitely Ted B's pool. But he's not here. He may have been eaten, which is sad, because I felt for the guy a little bit, at least. As much as you can feel for a character. <laughs> I hear a thug somewhere. That's interesting. Here we go. Now this... <laughs> yeah, this is where she is. Well, let's get this guy. This was apparently the uh, director of the porno that was obviously taking place here. Oh, did somebody follow you in? Yep. that up. ID card number one. So obviously this is probably one of the first places that you should visit um, in Dead Island, but we didn't follow this path actually. There's an alcohol for you, uh, Sayo, just in case you need it to give to him. So yep, there's Ninja Samajan. If you can't tell by the name, it's um, Jenna Jameson all mixed up. But this is apparently a porno gone wrong, and they're probably filming everything, so let's put this girl out of her misery. Yep, there she goes. Oh, there's a bolo machete. I'm taking that, too. There's a rusty pipe. So now you, you said you knew where that last guy was. Uh, well, the other guy is around here somewhere. So hopefully, he's, he's along this path here, I think. So I'm gonna make another waypoint and we'll just see where this leads us. If it doesn't lead us there, then I'm sorry guys. Hopefully this is entertaining for you anyway. Because at least we're covering the map for the most part. Jeez. Alright. I think those guys are taken care of. Let's keep moving. I think the closer we get to it, like every other mission that requires, and there's alcohol, 
um, that requires rescuing people because this is another rescue mission. I think uh, we're going to see skulls eventually if we keep going down this path. At least I hope so. I actually don't think I've ever gone down this way, so I'm really not sure what to expect other than zombies. Yep, there are the skulls right there. So let's take these guys out and then... Oh, let me do something really fast. Let me get out one of these bombs so I can get them all at once. Oops. Alright. Well, that took care of a lot of them at least. Hopefully that didn't take care of the guy who was supposed to save. No, he's fine. Good. <clears throat> Steve Summers. Take whatever you want. I gotta catch my breath. Uh, by the way, I'm Steve. Uh, this lifeguard came by. I think his name was uh, Simba. No, Cinnamoy. Yeah. S said I should come with him. But the son of a bitch had tattoos on his goddamn face. I'm supposed to trust somebody like that? Hoo -hoo. Looked like a damn cannibal. So I stayed put. Thought I was better off on my own. Probably not the best decision I ever made. Hmm. This guy's kind of a jerk. I don't know why he would not trust somebody like that, but... We can steal from him. It's perfectly fine. Oh, and there's a lot of alcohol for you. Or there's water. Water, rather. So if we if we run into Kim again, <laughs> I do like Kim. There's a personal idea over here. Did you make it to the bungalow? It's number twenty. Remember? There really is a lot of stuff in here. Brass knuckles. We don't need those. There's a Molotov. I can take that. <laughs> that door said that you could open it, but you can't. Can't hurt to look. There's a rag. I think that actually works with the Molotovs, but I don't really need it yet. And Danny is still calling for Luke, but we've already we've already helped that guy out. So, all right, so now we can uh, go back to the main quest and just let's see. Maybe I need to make another waypoint to the lifeguard tower. Which is... Where is it? Oh man, where is it? Mm -hmm. That's the pool house. There it is. There it is. Alright. So let's make our way back there. This is just going to be a journey, guys. We're going to knock out some zombies, but... This is pretty much just going to be us walking. <laughs> Actually, let's go this way because this is where the map's leading us to go or telling us to go rather. <clears throat> oh, I think this is the path that Omar took. Maybe. Oh. There we go. Oop. Ran into a post. So zombie up here. But I'm I think that uh, we've officially talked to all of the side characters on the island, at least. At, the, at least in this part, so that's actually pretty dang good. I mean, I'm, I'm happy about this. We didn't leave anybody out yet, you know, as far as I know. So far, so good. <clears throat> And it's nice because a lot of this stuff I didn't cover when I played it, played through it the first time, so it's nice to actually be able to now. Here the hotel bungalows. You can get the guy that's coming out of the pool. And I can take care of the guy that just fell in the pool. Awesome. Let me take whatever's on him, 18 bucks. 
Oh, 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 oh. Oh, man. I did not see him. Alright. So he is done for. Let me climb up this way. Are we good? We're good. I haven't even been to that bar, but I'm sure there's alcohol if you if you would like to go over there. You wanna go check or hmm? Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. I did not see her. Okay. You just leveled up. <clears throat> we can mess with skill points when we get back. Yeah. This is definitely the path that Omar took. I think I remember some infected, but they're not here yet. So. Oh! Yeah, I think I think it was just for that too. Nice, I leveled up too. But yeah, also, uh, the more you level up, the better items you get. Or at least, um, at least I think so. The items you get in the chest, at least. Those are always better. Because the weapon skill to use, uh... So now we can just talk to Cinemoy. And get on the right path. Yep, our truck respawned. There it is. Nice. Just in case we need it. Let me get rid of this waypoint. Here. Yeah. There you are. Good job. I didn't want to say so, but I was afraid it might not be there. Oh, right. The, <laughs> the uh, armored van. I was like, what are you talking about? But anyway, let's talk to him one more time. We heard somebody on the radio talking about a chopper going down. From what they said, the crash site's pretty close by. Maybe you can check it out. Yeah, I'll give you a hand. Look for survivors first, and then see if there's anything in the wreckage worth saving. Alright, so the next quest we do will be Blackhawk Down. Let's see what the... Ah, nice. The shot mod. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, I like that one. That was my favorite. <laughs> At least until we get better shock mods. But this is a good part to end, or a good place to end it. I hope you guys enjoyed watching us pretty much talk to everybody on the island or everybody who's alive at least and uh, I hope you guys like the ninja ninja summer John or however you say her name Jenna Jameson I'll just say that um, but uh, until next time I'll see y'all later <laughs>